Hello. Welcome to Tech for the Non-Tech. My name is David, and I'm here to make technology easy for you. No matter where you are in the process of understanding technology, whether you're brand new to it or you've been around it for a long time and you understand it pretty well, I'm here to answer the questions that you might have. Now those questions could be any number of things. It could be, how do I hook up my TV? I don't understand what all these cables are for and what everything's doing here. Um, how do I use my laptop? How do I keep viruses off here or spyware? What is virus or spyware or even malware? I've heard these terms, but I don't really know what they are. What if I want to hook my camera up to my computer? How do I do that? How do I know which computer to buy? There's so many questions out there, and it seems like the answers are so complicated that it's hard to understand. And you can spend hours searching and searching for the answers, only to wind up more confused in the process. Because let's face it, most of the answers are designed for people who really understand what the question was to begin with. I know, that doesn't make any sense, right? Sometimes people give you the answers, but you almost have to be technical to understand what they're saying. I want to change that. I want to take your questions and your topics and focus on you and what's best for you. I want you to understand technology in a way you've never done it before. Most of it's actually fairly simple. You just may have never heard it explained in a way that you could understand. So that's my goal. With the start of this page, I'm wanting to start a site that you can go to to have your questions answered and to be shown how to do this step by step. Now, a little bit of background on me. I've been a public school teacher for about seven years and I've been in IT or technology since about 1996 in some form or fashion. So I've been doing this for a little while now and I've got a really good grasp on technology. There's not much I can't do. I've done programming. I've done computer hardware, software support, networking, web design, multimedia installation with TVs and projectors, and worked with interactive whiteboards and printers and graphic design software. I've been through the gamut on most of these things. And the one thing that I understand more than a lot of people is it needs to be simple to understand it. I don't like spending a lot of time going through training only to be scratching my head thinking, oh man, what did he just say? How I don't get this. This doesn't make any sense. So I'm going to explain it in a way that makes sense to you. That's my goal to you. We're going to work on this together. I'll use analogies you can understand, short little stories that you can understand, and we're going to make sense of computers and technology together. So, what do you do? This is where we start. All you have to do is ask the question. What is it that you want to understand? What is it that you want to know? Then, I'll work on explaining it to you in a way you can understand, in a way that does help you. And we'll figure this out together. Coming up in the next few days, I want to discuss what it is, what does it mean to buy a computer that you actually want. Most people walk into these big box retailers and they see a, a laptop and say, ooh, that one's pretty. Which computer should I buy? Only to be given, uh, well, what are you using it for? And then they ramble off a whole bunch of numbers. Well, this one has one terabyte and four gigabytes, and it has 3.6 gigahertz dual-core 
processor and what does that mean does it matter and are those numbers really what indicates you're getting a good computer? I mean, some of these things are $299 and some of them are $1,500. So how do I know that I'm getting a good computer? Well, we're going to talk about that. I'm going to break it down for you. I'm going to explain what it means to get a good computer and how to select it so that you're not stuck holding a computer that in a month, two months, or even two years down the road, you're going to hate. But again, we're going to do this together. We're going to explain it so it makes sense, so that you understand it. So, if you want to take the time, shoot me a question. Shoot me a topic. Let me know what it is you want to understand, how it works, how it functions, and I'll get right on that for you. We'll cover as many of these as we can, and hopefully it will make sense to you when we're done. I look forward to hearing from you. Thanks.